Here it comes again. The piss rises once more. I have to add a disclaimer to this stream. I am dealing with very, very miserable abdominal pain that comes and goes. I feel good enough to stream. I wouldn't be streaming otherwise. But after I ended stream yesterday, I basically spent the entire night uh, fully reclined in my chair. Too weak to type. It was really weird. And I don't need any fucking doctors in chat to pr like diagnose what happened to me. But uh, I think it's Crohn's related. I had a really bad night last night. <laughs> But I'm, I'm feeling better now. I don't have a horrible abdominal nightmare anymore. I just have, like, sudden cramps. But, uh, I've been... I've been feeling better. It's just, uh... You know. You know. It's just... Bear with me, because last time I felt great at the beginning of my stream, and then over the course of three hours, I, like, actually deteriorated into nothing. But... I mean... I want to stream more piss game. This game was fun. It was actually remarkably fun. And um, I am excited to play more of it. I still need to, we need to find a place to live, dude. I have an idea. But we did get set back a little, by the way, uh, because the cave system we were in, I mean, I don't think anyone fucking like cares that much about this. There was no save point in there, and when I ended stream yesterday, I alt f would the game and immediately stumbled to my bed and, like, actually fell, like, face first into it. So I didn't, like, really, like, save my game, so we're back at wherever I saved last. Uh, I really just didn't- I- I couldn't, dude. I- I literally- I was- I, I was miserable. It's not like we lost anything. Matter of fact, I think we gained things by not having gone in there. The map is so big. But that might just be because we're so slow. Good news is, where the game saved, I didn't notice this chat. There is a runoff pipe tube in the distance that you can actually go into. A real one. So I think if we're gonna find our destiny, it's gonna be in the tube. There's a real tube full of piss right across the lake. I think I really just do need to like settle and be like, this is my house. This is my car. My car got to the house. And like now I can, cause like most of the map exploration is finding unique items. There's not much that you're gonna find in one place. That you're not gonna find somewhere else as far as like the, like there's only six crafting items in the game. Right, like there's really not much. So, the location I live in doesn't really matter so much as that I am able to access other places easily to get more supplies once I drain everything out of the place I'm currently living in. So, should be, should be able to find something. The city though, God. The interesting thing is, I don't even, well, no, I get to the city by going to the like big flats which I now know is absolutely car county rip sledgehammer yeah but who fucking cares about that dude that sledgehammer was the worst item I'd ever held in a survival game I think I think that thing was actually shit I don't give a crap about that sledgehammer the axe was literally better for combat and breaking things this animation was too slow and it used like half of my this again and then what well, looks to be 11 question marks. No, that's 10 question marks. That's right. I'm playing the PP game again because it's actually fun. Do you know how hard it is to find variety games that I want to play a second time because I enjoyed them? Plus, I had to cut this stream short because I felt so bad yesterday. Like, chat, like, usually, sometimes, like, when I end stream because I feel bad, it's like, ooh, I don't, like, I got a little headache started. Yesterday was, like, actually, like, a holy shit, I spent the rest of the day, like, I basically lost my Wednesday. After stream, I didn't do anything. <laughs> I couldn't even, like, I couldn't even, like, s like, play a game on my PC. Like, I couldn't even, like, do anything. And once the abdominal pain chilled out for a second, it switched to... Uh, me getting a horrible tension headache in the back of my neck 
that kept me up for another four hours when I was trying to sleep. Because I was like, I'll go to sleep early. Because I feel like shit. I'll go to sleep early. And I'll wake up early. At like 8 a.m. I'll wake up and I'll have a whole day to like salvage the day I lost yesterday. You know, like that kind of thought process. And then anyways, I like ended up instead just getting a horrible fucking headache off of it. Which kept me up anyways. I was trapped in an unending cycle. But I'm feeling better now, aside from like... Sometimes I get like 30 second long abdominal cramp things. But I'm feeling better. I'm feeling better. Just gotta stay hydrated. Ugh. You smell better. Thank you. Why, thank you. Thanks. I'm so confused about this game. All right, what's confusing you? What's confusing you? How bad are your migraines from Crohn's? It wasn't a migraine. It was, I just had a tension headache. Look, Jet. Until I've had my proper, like, full-on MRI that I'm supposed to have on Wednesday to, like, diagnose the exact kind of thing going on in my intestines, uh, I'm not gonna, like, be like, I had, this was an exclusively Crohn's-related incident. I might just had a really bad night. You know what I mean? It might also be that, but I don't want to like, I don't want to just like, there was a lot of stuff that didn't make sense. Uh, it could have just been a really bad night. Probably for the piss. Probably as a, it was probably like, yeah, it was probably like Jesus punching down at me because I played a game about piss for three and a half hours on stream. They tried to stop me. That said, I will always blame my horrible abdominal pains exactly where my small intestines are on my crows. <laughs> that said, I can blame whatever's going on with me right now on that. I'm allowed to do that. As long as it's in my tummy, I'm allowed to say it's that. I'm just not gonna like be like, I have a headache. It's my fucking intestinal problem. I, my, my eyes are dry. That's why I ate Crohn's. Tell me hurt disease. Honestly, right now the real issue is that in order to help out with the tummy hurting, I have to take ibuprofen. But if I take ibuprofen, my blood pressure rises. If my blood pressure rises, then I get blood pressure headaches. So it's like I'm getting rid of pain just so I can have it later. It's a never-ending cycle of bullshit. The ride never ends. Another cursed stream dot dot dot. Yeah, but at least in this one, I won't be experiencing like chills. Like, I, dude, it was like everything. As soon as I ended stream yesterday, like legitimately, uh, I cranked up the heat in my room to 76 by the end of it, and I was shivering. But my temperature, when I checked it with a thermometer, was normal. Like I had a wild night. Like I couldn't touch my back to my chair because my skin was too sensitive. It was weird. I feel way better now aside from my tummy. Everything else is fine. I'm not getting like nauseous when I stand up. Didn't have a fever. I was haunted. I must have been haunted. Ah, uh, yes, Crohn's chills. No. You can't just be like, you can't just add Crohn's as a prefix to every single thing that happens to me from now on and be like, ah, yes, it's your chronic immune disease. Forever. 
He's got the crones wobbles. I did think it was pretty fucking like, uh, I think it was, a, it was it was pretty cool though that the stream that I felt the most fucking violently ill afterwards was the stream that everyone while the stream was going felt the most violently ill ever watching my streams. Like that was an interesting dynamic. It's kind of like I had to receive the concentrated like discomfort of everyone watching for the whole stream. Very immersive. <laughs> Very immersive. I felt like I was really there in the urge. Bro, your kidney stone is hatching. I do know one day I'm gonna have kidney stones too. Chat, you don't become this chiseled and perfectly crafted as I do without having every single part of your body fall apart on the inside. You can't do both. You can either A, have the insides going really good or B, have the outsides going really good. My insides are not going very good. No, they're not going very good at all. It's just a funny little rock collection. I just, dude, what fucked me up was that when my mother had kidney stones when I was like a teenager, of right after, like, it was the scariest shit because, like, it was, like, it was wild. It's wild seeing someone go through that. And then she looked at me and she said, this is worse than having, and then like, like birthing you and your t like two siblings, all of them. And then I was like, and I, and then like when I got back, like when she got back from the hospital, I got back from like school the next day. She was like, you're going to probably have these ones. <laughs> <laughs> and ever since I've drank lemonade every single day. Because that's how you keep them from showing up. Uh, she was like, you're next. I'm like, but it's not. But I don't want to feel the pain of childbirth. I don't want to do that ever. I thought I got really lucky in that that's never on the docket for me. I was like really, that was like, that was like, I was pretty hyped about that. I, I, would, I would dare say I was stoked knowing that I would never have to give birth in my entire life. Like, I, for one, firmly still believe that we should just really pivot towards every child being born in a tube. Why should anyone have to deal with that kind of pain ever? Fuck that. You know how, like, inconvenient it is to lug around that big fucking pile of meat as it grows? I'm sure it is. I mean, I can't, I'm not doing that because, again, can't. But I think we should get to tubes really fast. Crypto babies again. Birth is a miracle. Yeah, a real nasty one. <laughs> why couldn't why, why why couldn't God have just like fucking dropped down like a box and if you like punch in the right information you want for the child just pops out a little lad. You know? Pops him out. The stork, I wish the stork was real. Grow them from seeds, you know, like kind of like actually grow them like sort of like a mandrake. So you just like once their hair starts growing out, you know that like they're ready to come out because every like, you know, like little, little like extremely newborn babies are fucking absolutely obnoxious. Wait till their hair come, like starts growing out and just like yank them out from the dirt. That's how you know. And they just start, you know, screeching like a mandrake, except it's just a baby crying and then carry on like normal. Like Pikmin. What if it's a bald baby? Then in the next 15 to 20 years, as that baby grows up into full adulthood and they remain completely bald, they will crawl out of the dirt having been forgotten by the ages and stumble into the adult world having never interacted with another person in their entire life. Wild man.
King Biffo origin story. They become a Twitch chatter. Mean. Mean to the chatlets. Don't think of it. Yeah, don't think of it like them being forgotten to the ages. Like... To the passage of time because they couldn't grow a head of hair. Think of it like letting them marinate in the dirt until they, you know, grow up. But it's like the problem with that is still at the end of the day, none of it matters because you can't monetize th this form of like uh, children. You just can't monetize it. So what's the point? I'm going to loop back around to crypt crypto. Now, because again, uh, it is, I think, the better option. Growing them in the dirt doesn't really get you any kind of monetization options. Century egg baby. Oh. Oh. Birth is beautiful, Tomato is just a freak, chat. Uh, wrong. It's one of the nastiest things I can think of in my entire life that happens to the human body. It's just the most gross thing. So is pooping. Exactly! They're both- Listen! Everything from the waist down is pretty nasty. <laughs> Come on! Like, I don't want to see any of it. And that's why I'm playing the P game. Because I'm trying to overcome my fear. It's all nasty. The waist up ain't much better. True. He's playing Piss Planet? Question mark, question mark, question mark. Again? Question mark, question mark, question mark. Yes, I fucking am. Why is he playing it? That's the same guy? No. No, it's not the same guy. I was about, if that was the same guy, I would have been like actually fucking disappointed. I would have been like, you're telling me they did a redo and I fucking fell for it twice? Bad memory. Well, look, the thing is, a same guy situation could happen. I don't usually read people's chat messages. I, like, recognize chatters that are here a lot, but, like, I don't read, like, the names all the time, if that makes sense. Like, I'm not always over here, like, clocking every single fucking name that types in chat. Unless, of course, you've gifted, like, uh, subs or given me money or really, like, earned, like, my recognition in any kind of way via f uh, financial input. Like me? Yeah, like you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you. Tyru, thank you for the five gifted subs. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thanks. Just, yeah, just like you, uh, c c um, uh, Cobnor. I remembered it. It scrolled by, but I still remembered it. DK Depa, thank you for the five gifted subs as well. Tomato, you are the biggest urge streamer at the moment. Currently one of two. Nice. <laughs> Huge W for urge streamers everywhere, dude. We are pushing this game up the leaderboards on Twitch. Dude, the people will know. Yeah.
if we get enough other streamers to play Urge, we can push down like shit games. Like right down off of like the game directory. Just push them under. Imagine being a game that's under Urge. Imagine being a game that's under Urge. Think about it. We have to saturate the market. We need to bring more streamers in. We need more people playing Urge. We must. It's the only way. We have to. We must saturate. Ocarina of Time is currently below Urge, and that means that Urge is a better video game than Ocarina of Time. Is anyone surprised? Nintendo just got owned by a P game. been a long time coming let link piss that's right the real lesson every developer should take from this is that if their game is beneath urge probably the only way to bring it up above urge is to add pissing mechanics to your video game let link piss let him piss Tears of the kingdom with quotes around tears. Awful. 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 Just terrible. The one game that can rival Urge is Postal. Uh-uh. Po oh my god, I fucking loathe Postal. The only good Postal game is the fucking, like, boomer shooter one. Brain damage is good, all the other ones are shit. Brain damage, awesome. Others, not awesome. Good is a strong word. Brain damage was great. Brain damaged was awesome. That was like a genuinely good shooter. The other ones are all bad. I never beat brain damage though. But that was mainly because it, I, it came out I played it, and then immediately off of it, I played Ultra Kill, and then it, I felt bad playing another shooter because Ultra Kill had points in it, and I liked seeing points when I did something cool. So, like, my logic was that I just couldn't play the game without having points appear, even if the points don't mean anything. I was just like, I can't play Brain Damage anymore right now because I need something to tell me I did good. Because otherwise, I ju I'm just playing a video game to play it, and what's the point of that? I need numbers going up all the time. Literal monkey brain. Literal. Literally. Literal. Can you help me name my mech? Uh, a, st a stupid idiot. S name, LMAO. <laughs> My streamer. Dude, I'm wrecked with incredible abdominal pain. 
Do you want me to fucking be like creative? I am. I wouldn't put it past my abdomen to like actually have a, like a xenomorph in it at this point. <laughs> okay, that's like that's where my abdomen was at yesterday. Is if a xenomorph had poked out of my my belly, I would have been like, "Yep, adds up." I knew I should have cooked those eggs longer. I knew I was worried those eggs were undercooked. I, I, I probably should have made sure that. <laughs> You ate Taco Bell again, huh? Dude, really the best thing that happened to me... Actually, you know what? No! You know what I'm gonna fucking say? I didn't eat that great the last couple days. I didn't have Taco Bell. But I also know... That over the course of time... Between, t like, yesterday when shit was really bad, and, like, today... Like, the very day before that, I ate great. And I had a lot of good food that was healthy. And it didn't fucking matter. None of it mattered. My diet didn't fucking impact how bad I felt yesterday. I know that for a fucking fact. My diet didn't matter in any direction. I've been really careful to follow, like, my nutritional guidelines, despite not always eating, like, the best food for me possible. And I don't think Crohn's fucking cares. <laughs> I think I learned yesterday that Crohn's didn't care. I think it just kind of laughed at me. I have Crohn's and it doesn't give two shits. Well, what if I load up my tummy with probiotics? You know what I mean? What about that one? What if I give it a lot of probiotics? I haven't done that yet, but that's only because a lot of the, like, I haven't had a chance to get, like, those premium probiotics that cost, like, a million billion dollars because I've been lazy. Only yogurt diet. I mean, I have like a daily smoothie to get my, like a, a daily good old smoothie. Get some fruit in me when I'm not just eating fruit all the time physically. Get some smoothies in me. I get, I try, I be very, I'm very careful to like have a good nutritional spread lately. And, uh, dude, it didn't do anything. Dude. Crohn's does care, but only if your large intestine is also affected. You see, that sucks for me because the doctors sat me down and they said there's nothing in my large intestine and it's all my small intestine. So that's like the worst thing you could say to me. So what you're saying is I should instead embrace enjoying myself and eating a bunch of garbage because none of it ever mattered. And I've been punishing myself for nothing. Beast, man. <laughs> yes, man. Nah, I mean, like, there's also the thing of, I like eating food that's good for me because it makes me feel good. Like, I will, or I will get myself a good salad because it makes me feel better. Like, just in general. I, I experience massive dietary guilt. Is that I, is that the right term? Where I'll just eat something that's totally fucking nasty for me, and I know it's bad for me, and I'll feel immediate guilt for it, even as I'm eating it, and it'll ruin the meal for me, even though it tastes good. Vegetables are so good. Yeah. But the burg, though. Well, that's what I do is I always have I eat good food for like two days straight and then day three is the day I get a little nasty all right that's always how I do it day three is when I have the when I get the nasty stuff Tomato, did you know the grill stripes in the Burger King patty are actually painted on? No, because I haven't gone to a Burger King since I was fucking eight.
and I and, and I don't think I ever will go to one. If I had to choose a place to get burgers nearby that was fast food, I got a Five Guys and a Wendy's that are both within that level of distance where it's convenient to purchase their product. So I'm not about to like I'm not about to do that. Blessed be. I feel like Wendy's has gone downhill lately. Yeah. I don't really order Wendy's. I don't really get Wendy's. I mean, I might get five guys tonight because I'm just like, no, no, I, I, dude, I suffered yesterday and basically had an all liquid diet because I couldn't get anything else into my body. Like, I had soup and a smoothie for dinner. But I genuinely didn't eat anything with mass. Tomato soup, broccoli cheddar. All right. So there was at least something in there. I can't just do normal liquid soup. It's gross. Broccoli cheddar soup should be labeled as a stew as far as I'm concerned. Someone said, ew. To broccoli cheddar. What? My guy, what? Broccoli cheddar might be one of the best soups out there. Like, that's a top tier soup. Brock cheddar sounds nasty. Yeah, but have you tried it or are you just judging it by the name? Because that's one of the best soups out there. That's like a mean soup, dude. That's like, that soup is, uh, that soup's S tier. French onion, also S tier. But French onion, French onions only S tier if you're getting it like fresh from the restaurant. It's not getting like delivered to you or any insane shit like that. Like you have to actually be able to like eat it quickly once it's like prepared or else like the bread will disintegrate. It's gotta be, it's gotta be fucking Omega fresh. Bread bowls are the shit. I've never had a bread bowl. Mainly because the only times I would have a bread bowl is if I ordered it from a place that sells bread bowls. And I know for a fact that that would not make it to my house in functional order. Like it would be like all nasty by the time it got to me. Unless I sell, unless I ordered a bread bowl from a restaurant and was like, put the soup that goes in the bowl on the side. Which I guess is fine. But the problem with that is sometimes if a place doesn't see that, like, detail in the order, they'll just be an asshole and do the thing that they know is going to fucking ruin it by putting it in preemptively. And, like, I don't want to risk that. You know what I mean? Like, I don't want to risk having my food show up and be nasty because I want to eat my food when it gets here. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, so I try not to order things that rely on someone seeing an instruction to make it edible for me or enjoyable as a meal. Like, I don't want, yeah, I don't want my, my soup loose in a bag. You know what I mean? Like, I don't, I don't want someone to just dump a bread bowl soup loose into a paper bag and then try to ship it to me. You know what I mean? Do you ever cook on your own tomato? All the time. I cook on my own all the time. But, uh, some nights I just don't feel like it. Some nights I was actually going to cook something last night and then I couldn't stand up. So I didn't. Lazy boy. Abdominal agony boy. More specifically. I probably need to take more ibuprofen soon. 
In like an hour, I need to remember to take more ibuprofen. And I, I'm like, I'm, I'm accepting that I'm just gonna have a, like a higher blood pressure tomorrow or whatever. But I need to take ibuprofen. I won't be able to like stream and do D and D later. I have to. It'll be necessary. He's getting zonked on ibuprofen. Yeah, getting old sucks. I'm not, it's not that I'm getting old, it's that I have a, I have a chronic intestinal disease <laughs> that is causing me, like, a, a very bad pain, specifically. Copium. <laughs> nah, it's old. Dude, if it was just getting old, then I could rest assured that all of you are also going to deal with it, and that would bring me some fucking comfort in this world. All right? It would bring me some fucking comfort to know that all of you are going to catch this fucking real stinker I caught. All right? But no. <laughs> that would bring you comfort, question mark? Yeah, I'm a spiteful piece of shit. And if I'm in pain, everyone should be in pain. That's how it works. What is wrong with you? Yeah, nothing. What's wrong with all of you? What Crohn's does to a man. <laughs> Dude. Bro. Chronically sick AF. Thanks. I think that's a compliment. I don't know. But yeah, I'm okay. It was just, yesterday was just really bad. <laughs> but I'm okay. I'm not, I'm, I'm feeling better. Like even as like the last uh, 40 minutes of the stream has gone by, I felt better. I just need to remember to take ibuprofen in like a half an hour or an hour so that I remain feeling better because I know for a fact that it is uh, helping me greatly right now. I never take it because I'm not really supposed to, quote unquote, but yeah, uh, that's a, that's a problem for my fucking cardiologist. You know what I mean? <laughs> that's a problem for my cardiologist to worry about come March when I see them, when they inevitably put me on actual blood pressure medication, which I should have been on for the last like four years. And they just didn't put me on it because my old doctors fucking sucked and my new doctors had to play catch up to fix all of my shit because my old doctors sucked so bad. He is fucked. My whole body's so bad. As far as I know, blood pressure meds are for life, no? I don't know about all that shit, but I do know that most of the time if you have a like, f like genetic family, like basically issue where your blood pressure runs very high in your family. As time goes on, it just runs higher and higher, like naturally all the time. So typically if you're in my case, usually you do end up being on some kind of medication or having like extreme dietary restrictions for life because that's just how it works. And then yeah, eventually you explode. Just <laughs> blow up. I just hope that when I explode and blow up, I explode and blow up in like a bathroom or something where my family can very easily scrape up my remains and dump it into a coffin. Cause like, otherwise it's going to be such a fucking pain to like mop all that, you know? 
I hope it's somewhere like relatively enclosed and small. Did you at least take brave or athletic to balance out all of the bad traits? Uh, I took short-sighted. Uh, I took uh, chronic intestinal disease. Uh, I took horrible anxiety. I took travel insomnia. Um, normal insomnia. Uh, let's see. Um, weak skin. And, uh, haunt it. And my positive traits are, uh, I, I, I got, like, this thing, I, I mean, like, I can, like, uh, I can run kind of fast. Yeah, I did take Wild Wasteland, which is why, like, sometimes, like, animals break into my house and, like, steal stuff. And then run away. Bro, you need to re-roll. <laughs> Dude, I don't know if that's a good idea. I don't I don't think I want to re-roll. Dude, we got to get this guy to re-roll. In in the context of this conversation that comes with very sinister implications. Dude, we need to get this guy to re-roll. His build sucks. Hey, I'm back. Sorry about that, chat. Uh, oops. Not really my fault, but, um, I still haven't switched to the proper new stream PC setup thing because it, uh, doesn't have any, uh, fucking slots for drives. Uh, my brand new one, so I can't move the stuff I want to move to the game PC. But, um, did you re-roll? <laughs> I fucking wish, man. I wish it was that easy. God damn. Yeah, guys. I went, uh, I turned off my, uh, stream and I, uh, freaking did the reroll. I got, uh, I, I had to sacrifice, uh, all motor function in my thumbs in exchange for, uh, less pain in my tummy. That's what I did. I got, I can't use my thumbs anymore, but I have, I'm feeling a little better minus the thumbs. The thumbs are bad. The thumb part is really bad. Everything else though, feeling great. Feeling, I would dare say, really great. I at least got to use that time to stumble upstairs and actually grab the ibuprofen I need. So not all was lost, it just, boy, I don't think, any, you know what, it wouldn't be as bad if Windows did all of its fucking updating on the first time, like, it activates the update. You know what I mean? But instead, Windows does this fucking bullshit where it's like, hey, uh, I'm going to restart your computer. And that restarts it once and says, okay, update's being installed. Okay, I'm going to restart your computer again. And then I go like, okay, you better be done then. And then it launches back up. It's okay, we're updates installed. And I'm like, did you not just, what was the part you just did then? I don't know. I have to restart again. Like, Fucking hell. I'll tell you what though, I swear my Windows 11 PC, like the game one, I haven't seen any updates go through for it. I don't know what the deal is. I, I haven't seen any. Maybe it just does them faster. Or maybe, I don't know, Windows actually fucking does them in the background or something now properly instead of forcing it to happen. Windows 11 fucking sucks eggs. Oh yeah, no, it sucks eggs. It's so bad, but at least I don't have to spend 18 hours waiting for it to fucking launch. But god damn, man. Nothing makes me immediately angrier than my PC having forced updates after a crash. Oh! <laughs> 
but I'm fine now. I'm cool. I'm cool. I'm still on Windows 98. No, you fucking ain't. <laughs> no, you ain't, man. How do you know? I know. You calling them a liar? I'm calling them a freaking liar. It's bullshit, but I believe it. Huh? What? Huh? What? I'm on the Ouya. Hell yeah, man. Now that's a disrespected console that was deserved more of a chance. I say, not really knowing anything about the Ouya, but liking the name. The name was good. Ouya. Everything else about it, I mean, I could only tell you one game that was on it. It was Amazing Frog. That's it. And Towerfall, which I, I didn't play that. Ooh, yeah, more like, oh, yeah, more of that, please. True. Y'all excited for the Stadia? I mean, it's already been out, but, like, is anyone excited for the Stadia ever? They're done now, aren't they? Is the Stadia gone? It's dead. Oh. That's sad. That's, uh... That's sad. Thoughts on GameCube? Lunchbox looking ass motherfucker. All right? <laughs> I don't... I don't give a shit about that. I think that console looks stupid. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Yeah, dude! Yes, man. See, my problem with today was that I forgot, because of my horrible abdominal pain, I forgot to restart my stream, like the PC I used to send the stream, the one that blue screened. Because that's typically been the thing that's prevented it from blue screening, is I restart it uh, every day. Instead of, like, putting in the sleep mode, which I have a bad habit of doing. I mean, like, some places, sometimes, you, I, I don't know, I, I, I try to restart it every day, and that seems to set back the horrible blue screens. But I forgot because of my tummy. Hell yeah, streaming on eggshells. That's hardcore mode. Dude, it's literally Elgato. Like, I swear, man, if a better fucking capture card, like, maker came out that didn't suck more than Elgato already sucks, I would uh, immediately pick it up. Like, a, a better built-in capture card. But there aren't any. I've done the research. Elgato's still the best, unfortunately. Uh, for built-in, like, PCI capture cards. Just use your camcorder. Hello? True! Yes, dude! Like, uh, capture, capture cards are basically... Elgato's, like, basically... No competition. There's like the Aver Media ones, but they suck eggs. <laughs> and like Razer did like a thing at one point, and they also suck eggs. Just Discord share screen with us. You think that would do it? Use fraps. Dude, I can't believe at one point people used fucking fraps. Holy shit. For like recording video. Nasty. <laughs> Nasty. You know how much fucking footage that shit took, like, took up? Fraps was like Five minutes of video was like three gigabytes or some insane shit. I used DX Tori back in the day. That was my recording pr uh, platform was DX Tori. 
up until uh, OBS became like a big thing and it was easier to record with OBS. But up until OBS, DX Story was king. You used DX Story if you wanted to make like good recordings. Unregistered bandy cam. Dude. You see what I would do is I would just mash the print screen button. When I played games, I'd mash the button. And I'd capture every single frame by like just taking screenshots. And I'd just be recording the game audio using like uh, some like, you know, really basic like audio recording thing. And I just kind of squeeze the, uh, the two together. Like audacity. Yeah. Really? More piss world? What's left to see? You guys hate this game. What the hell? We barely saw anything in it. We need to relax. You need to relax. This game reminds me a lot of Arx Fatalis for some reason. Uh, not, I don't really see the, uh, the connection, but maybe. I don't remember it at all. I mean, I remember the game, but I don't, I don't think it connects to that, but maybe. My streamer got one guy. Can you blame me? The vo there's a vocal, there's a very vocal selection of the chat that hates piss game. They they hate it. They love the piss game. They hate urch. They like they hate it. They hate it, bro. I see the forest more so in this game than anything. Yeah, that's why I've been enjoying it. It's very the forest. In its exploration, its monsters, its like world. Aside from the fact that in the forest, I don't remember my guy pissing. I don't think he had to go to the bathroom in that game. This game makes me anxious. It should definitely make you anxious. It's because they're weak. Because they don't understand anything. They can't handle urge. Why is Piss Drinker TTV an allowed Twitch name? Is there, how would you know that's an allowed Twitch name unless there was an example of it being allowed in the chat right now? Do you, do you know that because you were attempting to make that account and it let you? You sick animal? Or are you perhaps the anonymous gifter? That's been a thorn in my side. Are you the accursed one? Did you just self-report? <laughs> Did you just self-report? The loathsome piss drinker. Well, now colonoscopy had to do it. Look at that. 
Thanks for the gifted sub. Also, Pax Blade, thank you for the gifted sub as well. Thank you. Yeah, keep throwing your fucking money away to people that'll never show up to the stream no matter what. Keep throwing it away. Keep throwing your money away. Anonymously. Pathetic. Pathetic! All right, I want to get into the game. I forgot that the intro is technically now almost an hour long, despite the fact that it was literally cut in half as a result of um, my computer breaking. Thank you for all the gifted subs. We're going to get into it. Now, chat, uh, we're not going to be in the cave system anymore because the game didn't save when that happened because I was feeling real nasty at the time I ended the last stream, and I just did not decide to go find a save point. I closed the game. Uh, but that's fine because we're actually in a better area that's going to really be more helpful for our lives today. We're going to have a much 14 minute intro. Did you not hear what I said? Did you not hear when I established uh, that I've been on my computer blue screen 15 minutes ago? Did you not catch that? There is an intro. It's out there. Literally. Come on, Elgato! Fight! Huh. Here we are. Chad, now I spawned in here earlier today because I didn't know whether... I couldn't remember if I had saved or not. I went out, I looked out the window, and I saw a fucking runoff pipe. That ain't the same one as last time. That's a real pipe that goes somewhere. All right, that's a real pipe. It leads somewhere, man. That's a real pipe. It's got a destination. Now, oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Oh. 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 Freak. Oh. That sucked. Welcome to Urge, everyone. Welcome to Urge. Welcome to this beautiful world we live in. We share it with creatures, horrible creatures of the night. We... We love this place. We just, we just fucking love this place. We really do. Uh, we've been looking around, still desperately trying to find a place to call our home, because god damn it, I really need to get that done. I don't need. I really like the wood is cool and all, but we get wood anywhere. We have an axe, carrying a stack of it. I, the wires are finite. I need to find a place to actually settle down. Okay, that's a tarp. That's actually, like, required. Drop the cloth. Grab that. That's huge. And, Chad, what I was thinking... ...was that, at the very least, first thing we do is we check out what... ...in... ...the cube. Hello? It got dark really quick. Okay, battery's looking good. Let's just get in there. We I don't know where any of these things go. Really, this map's fucking very big. It's a very big. Uh but uh Yeah, I'm hoping that we will be able to find a place soon that really because I don't want to live in one of those normal houses. Or wire. Wire's big. I don't want to live in one of the normal houses because I just feel like it's going to end up backfiring. Like, it feels like stuff just really gets in every window. 
Feels like a mess living in those places. This feels like a nice place to live. You know what I mean? Like, this feels nice. Adzalor, thank you for the 10 gifted subs. Pesky creature. Oh, this place sucks. I changed my mind. Hang on. It's not that bad. I just have to get rid of these two weirdos. I just have to get rid of these weirdos. Oh! And you're next, motherfucker. Yeah, you're gonna end up like that guy. You stupid bastard. Yes, what did I say? Dude. Okay, bye. That guy was doing his own thing. This place is busy. It's a fucking, it's a wonderful passageway. People love being here. Chad, you guys don't understand. This place has access to every sewage pipe within the entire valley. Oh, uh, oh it's scared of me. Or it's scared of something that was behind me. Hey, do you want to, what, what's up? Hey! Oh no, I'm, now he's mad. Ah, horrible creature! Okay, uh, let's just keep going. I need to get out of this place. This gotta lead somewhere. It's gotta leave somewhere cool. This place sucks. What have we here? Slime? I don't like the slime. I don't know what to do about the slime. It kind of hurts. I found out it hurts you if you touch it. I'm gonna heal. I don't know what- I have no idea what to do about the slime. Not going to lie, pretty pumped for piss world day two. Never knew how into piss I was. Okay, man. Well, I'm glad that you're excited. I really am. It's good to see enthusiasm like that. Where the hell am I? This is nice. We have like a garage. Where is it? Where are, where are we? Hmm. A kind of nasty room. Dinner 13. Well, I don't have a uh, VHS for this. But it looks like this is where they filmed the dinner series. What else is in here? Well, well, what is this? I don't know what any of this. But there's a lot of wood out there, though. I mean, let's take a look at what else is over here. There's no toilet in here. Wait a minute. Hang on. Hold up. Nothing. Strange. It's a strange place. It's lovely. Uh, I don't know if I'd call it lovely. But I would call it conveniently accessible. Possibly. I don't know. I need to check what's over here. Because if this is like... If this leads me to somewhere else that like connects to more buildings, like actual houses to loot and stuff, then this could be something. There's also piss rocks. That's something. The it's just a dump. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, that's a bummer. Uh, is that a gun? Oh my god. 
Wish I had ammo. I wish I ever had like I had ammo one time for one of these guns that I found. <laughs> well, that's depressing. Um, what's over here? Yo, hold up. Chat? This valley. Access to the runoff tube. Access to a giant fucking dump. A gas station over there. This feels central. And access to food in the form of bugs. Hang on, I wanna see if I can like drive my car up here and like fling it off the cliff because I don't know how to get around to this again, but I'd like to bring the car with me over that way. I think I should, I think I filled it up with enough to get it over, I hope. Oh, who am I kidding? We can't just take the car. We'll have to take the car all the way around. It's already out. God fucking damn it. This poor car needs so much piss. <laughs> this car just guzzles the stuff. Well, I need to like actually fill up bottles to bring over here to it then. But I can assume that if I hug this cliffside going all the way around here and around, I'll get back to that checkpoint. So I kind of want to just jump down here. Ah. Take a look around. Goods. Goods. This place might be it. We got goods. We got a multi-cal pistol. I'm just gonna leave that there for now. I don't have any inventory space. I need to find a place to settle down. We got the tube. Where creatures wander. You can, it looks like from the distance of the, these things, you can actually take your car into these tubes. Like they're designed to be driven with a car, which is cool. That's good. We can, like, ride our car up it. Oh my god. Could this be it? The promised land. What's stopping me from building a ladder up to the car? I know I can build stuff. Go away. What if I choose to live in like a kind of nasty garage? Lots of real estate. Animals scamper around. Give me your meat. Give it here. All of it. Drop it all on the ground. Fucking hell, it takes a long time. I think I have to delim them. Are you telling me this deer doesn't have meat? I'm starting to think this deer doesn't have any meat. Shit. Whenever I see, like, anything on the ground now, I keep on worrying I'm gonna have, like, a... Another freaky tube... Situation. If that makes sense. I like this place. If we can find, like, a good spot to, like, have as the... Sleep zone, quote-unquote, here. Wait. Huh? I thought this would be like a hole I could like live in, but it's just a grave. Not mine. Not mine, guys. Come on, but I do think someone lived over here. In this, in this nasty, nasty like RV. Damn, man. You lived in here? 
Holy shit. Why don't we simply become the junker? Like it's a junk man kind of situation who lives out in the junkyard and pees in bottles. We don't need a toilet. Do we need a toilet? Why can't I be the piss junker? Chat. Chat. Because think about it, chat. You're not thinking with your head. You're thinking with your, with your like, I don't know, emotions. Think about this. <laughs> we can get up to the car by using a strategic layer of ropes and pulleys and ladders. We can simply climb back up to where we need to be. No problem. No problem at all, man. <laughs> ah! It almost worked. Seems safe. It is. And once we can get up to the car, by God, we will be all set. Hang on, I just need to make another one. Ah! I'm gonna die doing this. There's gotta be a better way. There might be an invisible wall. That might be what's happening. But uh, if I can climb down the way I climbed up, well, if I can climb up the way I climbed down, I can probably just make a ladder there. I mean, this shit's cheap as hell. It's just one plywood. Wait, what the fuck? Chat? Oh! I fucked up. I am fucking dead, my guy. But we're back in the tube. Okay, but this will get me back up to the fucking thing. I made that meat. This goes back to the tube. Okay, so I can actually use the sewer tube. This is it. We're gonna live here. We have to. Not in the tube, but like outside of it. It's just... I need to heal. The slime is bad. I don't like the slime. We can live in the tube. Nah, creatures live in the tube. I'm gonna eat some food, because that'll heal me a little. Chat, trust me. This is exactly where we want to live. Now, I know what you're thinking. This isn't, like, a good place to live. You're freaking wrong. Hopefully, I have enough pee to drive this car off of the cliff. Hello? Is that a fucking... Is that an old bottle? Is he coming to fucking stab me with that thing? I think that piss junkie is about to come stab me. I just want the plywood. Dude, don't come any closer. I'm warning you, man, this thing's loaded! Oh, fuck. Why did I click? Now he knows. <laughs> he knows. All right, that's it. <laughs> that guy's dead. I think. I just need some plywood. Chat. I'm living in the junk. I've decided I'm gonna live in that warehouse. That warehouse is mine. We can pull a car in there. We can actually live in there. We can have like a full fucking life for ourselves in that place. I'm gonna live in that fucking warehouse. I just need some things first. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get my car over the cliff. I also, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to survive getting over the cliff again, but it's good to know that we can get to the car. Mm. 
Is it easy enough for me to- Dude, I'm telling you, man! There's not an invisible wall here! Held up! The problem is, I'm not good at... The game wants me to do the ladders like this. Hang on, how do I- how would I do this? Custom wall. Alright, we're gonna fucking let- we're- <laughs> This is- I mean, you gotta give the game some credit on the crafting. It's very robust. It's- it's got some robustness to it that a lot of other games don't have. <laughs> yes! <laughs> this will serve its purpose. Uh -huh. Such power. At the palm of my hands. Let's start setting up the base camp. We need a house. Which means I need wood. And lots of it. And a sink. Is there a sink in there? I need to save my game before I do anything. Piss is accumulating. It's fine. I'm gonna pour it all into bottles. The plan is to bottle it, and then take it up to the car. I need a sink to save in. Although, I think I can also build a sink. I can. Save basin. Well, I'd like to do that once I have a house. Because I'm going to make a- Chad, I'm going to make like a makeshift shelter. And like, uh... Put the save basin in there. Because I want to be able to pull my car in, so I want like a double layered kind of thing. I'm gonna need many wood. Doesn't the car make fog from piss? You can't make it omelet without meat without breaking a couple eggs, okay? And I need to drive. I need to drive. Come on. Come on. It's stuck on another tree. I also hear a creature navigating around. If it hits me, I'm fucking instantly dead, and that's gonna be really sad. Oh. How much wood? 19. And where's the thing that's currently rummaging around? Oh! Pesky worm trying to sneak up on me. I love my house. I love this place I call home. And I know in time, all of you will too. Or so help me God, you're gonna regret it. It's definitely a place, all right. And it will remain a nice one. All right, you left out the word nice, I added it for you. It's 
It's a nice place. Now check this out. First of all, confirm there's nothing nearby. Here's what I'm thinking. Okay. I want to set up a kind of garage here to pull the car in. I think that's nice. I think that's going to be good. We want a garage here. So I'm going to split this thing down like halfway. With a lovely door in the middle. <laughs> now the question is, do I build an actual house or do I give up and put an entire fucking shed in the house? Why can't I do everything? Perfect. A home in a home. I'm gonna make my save basin. Saved. Sorry, whenever I go into save it, like, fucks up Elgato for a second. We live like this! Okay. So that doesn't use any plywood, which is why I wanted to do that, because that's, like, free. Now, I also do want to make, like, an actual door. Uh, I don't know how big of a door I can make, though. Is that... That is just going to be a sideways door. Uh, I think I needed to start at the bottom. Oh, wait, hang on. Too big? Too big. Wait. Why don't I just make two doors? I always need one more wood. Dude, the crap- I mean, like, the base building in this game feels- it, like, it works pretty fucking well. <laughs> Now that we're, like, actually doing it. Okay, so I want the other door to open also out. Like, it basically needs to be, like, double door. Oh, it doesn't matter. As long as the handle is in the center. I mean, then again, I could also just make a wall for this side. It doesn't I don't need a double door. I could probably just make a wall on this side. Because I'm missing the pl I'm missing plywood. Hang on, I need more plywood. I might just make another like a wall. Well, let me see. Am I still? Oh, it's two plywood. Plywood is the problem. I know how to make more plywood. We use glue bars. Uh, I need to combine them with normal wood. And it makes plywood. So plywood's actually more valuable than normal wood, for, as far as crafting is concerned, from most things. It ain't much, but it gets the job done. Nice. I've got another half that I still need to, like, secure, but, like... We've got, like, an, like stuff going on. I think creatures will be able to easily smack that fucking door down, though, is my worry. Also, I think things will be able to fly inside the warehouse through those windows, which is why I also thought it'd be smart to make an actual secondary house. It's not symmetrical. Dude, it's never gonna fucking be. Like, the, like that's kind of the price you pay for having this much, like, freedom in, like, the, like, being able to choose how things are shaped. I don't think that's, it's that easy to do what you're asking me to do. I need a fucking dump corner for all my garbage. All right. We have three bottles fucking full of piss. And you just leave a bunch of stuff. Ideally in their own unique corners. 
There's got to be chests in this game. I just don't really have them yet. And I need inventory space, so we're dumping on the ground like an idiot right now. Until I can make a chest. Oh, this will be my- Oh, this will be the piss corner. Oh, hell yeah. Chest. Five wood, two metal sheets. We can do that. We should start making those. Uh, yeah, let's uh, pick up my stuff again and just go get some wood and do that. Finally, a place to pee. Not sure why I'm breaking this. Did it just give me wood? I guess it's just like an easy, another way to get wood if you didn't get it earlier. Oh, these are decorative trees. That's fine. I kind of like those trees there. Who puts skulls on sticks it, on my lawn? Oh, hang on. So, chat, what I'm basically going to do is right now, until the car is full, that's my toilet. And by that, I mean... Um, I'm going to... This is dangerous as all hell. Oh. I need this ladder gone. Oh. Perfect. Now it's less dangerous. Uh, I'm gonna use the car as a toilet. I'm gonna dump all my bottles into it and then also just pee in it. <laughs> like a freak. Until it's at full. And then hopefully by then I will have secured ways to make the environment clean and then I'll be able to use it. I can also fill my bottle from it, so once I have a way to like securely cleanse the piss... Well, uh, then we can just take all the fucking uh, bad pee out. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? You can cleanse it? That's right, I can cleanse the pee. I didn't stutter, did I? You can cleanse the frickin' pee. <clears throat> Ow! <laughs> Fuck, man! I need to eat food and sleep. That's the only way I'm gonna heal. This fucking travel is dangerous. Seems like my guy slowly heals up off of, like, the lowest tier of HP. Do I have five wood now? I do. Alright, I'm gonna make a chest or two. I don't know if I want to make these chests inside of my house or like, like under here. I'm gonna put them against. I'm gonna. Put, I am gonna put them inside. The first ones I'm gonna put inside. Hang on. So. Okay. So that lets me really finely do it. If I hold. Shift. Whoa. Lots of inventory space in a chest. Holy shit. Okay, that's big. Very nice. We're gonna make another one of those. Soon. But I need to save, because I'm gonna die soon, I think. And yeah, I'm gonna save right now. I'm worried I'm gonna get jumped by a creature soon. I want to make a fire. Or like a cooking station of some kind. Fire barrel. 15 coal, 5 metal sheets, 5 wire, 5 soil. I don't have any way to get soil. Chat, remember when we got that shovel? I think we actually need to go find where we got that shovel again. From that warehouse basement. That other one? I think we actually have to go find that to get soil. I think this is like, this game kind of works like the forest in that there are certain tools we simply need to get from the map. I wish there was a way to destroy furniture. But I don't think I can. 
Because I don't really want these here. Eh. Eh. Wire. The wire is very good. I wonder if the game lets me craft from the chest. Dude, I am a short fucking guy. I'm just perfectly missing the box. Give it here. More wire. E. E. Please fix your fingers. I can't. I can't. That's the way my character's fingers work, dude. I can't do that. I'm afraid that's not an option. Okay, so yeah, I definitely need the stuff in my inventory. I need three wood to make a fire. God, imagine you making fire out of plywood. I hope I didn't do that at any point. Okay, I'm gonna go cut down some more trees before the sun sets, which... The sun is setting. Tonight might be a dangerous night. I'm, uh, gonna try to sleep through it. But I need food for that, or I'm gonna starve to death. I'm gonna swing by the goods store once I grab some wood. And hopefully heal a little. Just need a way to make a fire. At least the game doesn't make us like make anything to like ignite the fire, you know what I mean? That's nice of them. It gets very dark in this game. Yeah, there's a reason I want to be in my house when the sun sets. I'm even tempted to seal up the window in my cottage. Like, I don't want to be out here at night. Truly. Alright, I'm gonna go to the goods store. See if there's anything I can get to eat. Since I didn't loot it earlier. And then we just pray. We pray that we make it through the night. All right. Anything? Fog spreading shells for a shotgun. Cloth. Blue bar. That's not food. Grenade. That's good to have, I guess. The gun that I saw before. The sun is going down. I don't want to break the rock. Was that food? No, that's acid. Okay, well, I've got the some food to cook break these garbage cans and bags if I can I'm trying to avoid breaking those uh, rocks because I think they make more urine urine I think they make more of the nasty gas that I don't want all right we're gonna get back to the base because the sun's now officially going down Let's get out of here. Let's get back. We'll make a fire. We'll probably seal up the, uh... My battery's going out in my light. I wish I had actually been able to make a door for both sides of this warehouse, but, um... It'll be alright. I know, I just realized now I don't have a bed in here. But I need a place to, like, save and cook. Oh god, this place sucks! This place is not ready to be lived in! And there's scary music playing! Okay, plan number one. We need to put all this shit away. That's for shotguns. I need to make, with the wood I have, a fire.
Yep. This place is nice. Don't worry, chat. We're gonna be fine. It's just dark outside. What's the? There's nothing wrong with it being a little dark outside. Oops. Eh. Eh. Okay. Now, what are the odds that I'm able to make myself a nice bed right now with one cloth? Low. The odds are low. Well, what I can do is set up a lovely candle. <laughs> At least it's gonna be nice. At least it's nice here, you know what I mean? Look, I'll probably run out to the house outside and sleep in there once, um... Once I've gotten myself, uh... Some cooked meat to eat. Oh! Why, God? Was that the fire? If that was a fire, I'm gonna reload. I'm gonna reload. That scared the shit out of me, but I need this house, dude. <laughs> Did the fire actually break it? I think the fire- I didn't see anything about like the fire burning it. Okay, well this is I think pre-fire. Technically, yes. Okay, in that case chat, I'm gonna go outside and we're gonna make the fire outside at the new ha at the sleeping zone, okay? Hang on, I just gotta grab a battery from the shack. Don't worry, guys. Stuff's gonna be... F Stuff's gonna be fine. No one's ever died to... Uh, no one's ever died before. I'm just gonna take a quick uh, trip to the murder shack where it's safe to sleep, and we'll cook up our food in there, and then we'll go to sleep. Things gonna be fine. This place is already pre-boarded up, isn't that nice? Now that was not what I fucking wanted. Give me that back. It turned it into normal wood. Shit, man. Fuck. It's fine. If anything scary shows up, I'll just fucking go to sleep. Everything's gonna be oh, okay. I own a grenade. I own a grenade, Chet. We're gonna be okay. Gotta wait for our food to cook up. Now, well, 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 why don't I, why don't I, uh... I don't want to make barricades. Or anything like that. We just, we'll just hang out for now. Yeah, we'll just... Hang out. Golly, it's quiet out there. dark and foreboding can we sing a song yeah you guys go ahead and sing a song if you want a b c d e f g h i j k l m n o p q r s t u v w x hang on We need to eat this. Oh, okay. I'm going to sleep. I gotta pee. 
Hang on, I gotta pee. The fire stayed lit all night. All right, I gotta haul all this piss up to the car. I think that fire will become coal. I'll wanna go pick it up soon. I didn't heal as much as I would have liked, but at least we lived. This fucking ladder sucks so bad. Like, uh -huh. there's an invisible wall above the ladder that tries to keep you aligned with the ladder and it actually makes it incredibly dangerous for me. All right, well, I drop this off. Oh, I thought that was a creature lunging. So how much of a full tank do we have now? Half full. All right, we still got a lot of juice left in this toilet. Before we need to start worrying about it. We got like a whole day's worth of piss left in that thing to fill. I always knew Volkswagen Jettas ran on pee. <laughs> Dude, true man, true. We all knew it. Okay, I had to be really careful getting down from here. Oh, okay. So, what's really good about the junkyard is we actually get a ton of metal sheets. Which, from what I've started to gather, is not exactly like a super always like around material. So, it's nice that we have a bunch of it. Like, we're getting a lot of stuff from living near here. Okay, so first step today, I want to get... Wait, this is a flare gun with terrible accuracy, which can take both shells and rifle rounds. Wait, really? Why does it say fog spreading? Are these piss bullets? Why does it say that? Why? But why though? I need cloth. All right. I think first things first, we really want to do like an explore the map and get some more materials thing. Cause like, We've got a lot of crafting. I don't know why the game goes, like, breaks when I enter the save menu. That's so strange. But, uh, we want to get ourselves, uh, cloth. Really everything. Nice. I should check behind this place. I don't know why I haven't yet. It feels like this game loves their secrets. Oh, uh, well, hello? Uh, what is this? Oh, I made a mistake not checking behind it. What the fuck is that? What is that? Oh! Oh! Bones. It's a dead end. There's something off about this warehouse. I think we can all agree there's something awry. But I just can't pin my- I just can't figure out what. Either way, we have ourselves a nice home that I actually want to live in. Go figure. Let's crack open all these boxes on the junkyard and try to figure out what the hell we're doing in this place. Loads of plastic bottles. I don't actually need all of these. I'm actually gonna start leaving some of them here. We have just so many bottles. 
We need another chest. We actually need like more chests. Set up a whole wall of them, I think. All right, let's go. I want to go to the gas station across the street. Too bad. Why can't we open the jump like the dumpsters? Like, come on. You tell me I can't open the dumpsters when I when my guy is I would describe it as the nastiest guy ever. He draws the line at opening dumpsters. I ain't never seen a guy nastier than this guy in my entire life. I'm like, this feels like a trap. You know what I mean? Like this crack. Like, going down here to, like, get treasure. Feels like that's, like, how one of those fart guys comes out and just kills me. Protein bar. That's huge. Save that for later. Nothing. Although, I'll say it's really, like, this feels like the most central part of the map I could pick. How much you guys want to bet that this tunnel goes straight to the city? One of these tunnels goes straight. Like, if you follow this tunnel, you get to the city. Hang on. Uh, filters. I want to turn down the color correction of this game a little. I just, uh, just adjust it like a microscopic amount. Okay. No more piss filter. No, the piss filter is there. It's just, I was realizing the contrast was a little too high. I don't want to touch these boxes, like the the rock ones. I know it's bad. I just need to I need to figure out how to make the uh, the purification thing before I start investing in extracting the precious resources from the piss. All right, let's find out what's in this, and I really hope this slime isn't gonna be a problem. I, I, like, what if the slime spreads like crazy? You know what I mean? Like, what if the slime is like a like a fungal thing from cataclysm level event? Then what? Okay, well these don't matter. Let's go up to the second floor. Nothing. 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 Battery. Nothing. Crap. Urine flammability. Due to the flammability of byproduct chemicals released in few subject bladders by an unknown entity, some individuals' urine samples had high enough concentration to be classified as fuel. Huh. Why was the note covered in piss? Maybe we just start calling piss fuel. Free ourselves from the word, you know what I mean? Oh, baby. Are you telling me this tunnel spits out right here? This looks familiar. If this is where the tube is, then we are in a nice fucking part of town. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, this place slaps. Oh, yeah, we picked a good place to live. We're in a good spot. I haven't looted this place. Give me the rest of the meat. I know you have more than that. My inventory's full? Eat that.
What is this? Well, I'm not sure exactly how I'm gonna find that. That's just trees. And why the hell is there a hole in the ground? Priority right now is get enough cloth to make a bed in the warehouse. Or the garage. Toilets? No toilets. No toilets for miles. Feels like the bones are gonna be good. I probably didn't need to bring all this crap. Uh, I'm gonna drink the alcohol to try to get some more HP. Cause that heals me. Alcohol is good for me, chat. Don't you? Didn't you? Didn't you get the memo? Alcohol is good for me now. God, my. I wish I. I know that we get chests. I wish I didn't suck so bad at inventory management. Wait, oh, that was my Molotov. No, 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 no. Uh, take this out. Pee in it. Take this out. Pee in it. Good. There ain't no way that isn't full of piss. Ain't no... I'm not opening it. I'm not gonna... Oh, I can see it seeping out of the bottom. I'm not opening it. That's gonna- that's bad for the environment, I'm not opening it. But I will go into this spooky hole. Oh! Did you do all this? Do you live down here? Give me meat. Give me meat. He's not giving it. Genuinely evil. From what you've seen, how could you even start to believe my character is a good guy? Like, come on. Like, really? Really? Checking if any of these walls are fake. Dogs barking about something. More fog spreading shelves. And duct tape. I don't think I need the. Mm, eh, I don't need this bottle of piss. I can tell you that much. Is my food done? Once this finishes cooking, we'll head on back to the base. Down here. This is a nice basement, though. I do like it. Minus the, uh... Minus the body in the corner. That's kind of nasty. The dead body? I don't like that. <laughs> Feeling good, having a good day. Let's get out of here. <laughs> All right. Returning back. To the warehouse. Let's go. So the next order of business chat is I need a plastic bag. Really badly. I've only seen one in the game ever and it was in the other run that I died in. I need that. I, we need a turlet. We need a turlet. 
as soon as we can. Do you ever feel? Yeah, sometimes. Gonna need a turlet. Gonna need a uh, way to get soil. Still not really sure. Gonna have to find a shovel for that. Probably want to make a way to measure the ur dust again in the new house. Don't want to have. Don't want to have all this horrible ur dust everywhere. Metal sheet and pipe is all I would need. So I need five wire and five wood, and I could make a yellow fog collector for the house. That'd be good. That protect. That would collect some fog. If stuff ever gets like dicey, I don't know if it's like it only works in the area though. Oh. Okay. We're still short one cloth. Which is a damn shame. Okay. Pipes don't stack. But I mean, like, we got a decent amount of stuff. And we have a way to declog my, uh, toilets once I own one. Erlid purifier. So I still need to be able to make... I need So the tarp... I found a tarp, which was good, because I'm going to need it for that. Okay. This is... this. It's just hard to figure out what the next step should be, if that makes sense. I think I need to find that shovel, which means really getting, like, figuring out where the fuck I live. Well, first things first, I think there's a mandatory must-have in this game, and it's the meter. So we need to get plywood, two duct tape, one wire, one glue bar from the box. Plywood, duct tape, glue bar. What's the last thing? Probably wire or some bullshit. We'll put this right next to the door so I always know how bad things are. Okay, good news is, uh, it's low. I can tell it's low. I can tell it's low. Good. I wish it was easy enough to, like, test how uh, high it was, but I'd have to, like, actually pee all over the ground to figure that out. And I don't really want to do that. Okay. Why would I want to collect rain? There's, like, so many things in this game where I'm like, I don't know why I'd want that yet. Like, I get why someone may want it. Maybe, but, like, I don't know why I want it. Like, why would I need salt, Peter? Because I can make a composter which would make salt, Peter, but why? Why would I fucking do that to myself? Well, I do know one thing I'm gonna make. It's another chest. Oh, hell yeah, they let you stack them. Good shit. I like it when games let me do that. Cool. Uh... Empty out my inventory. Minus the flashlights. Uh, ditch that grenade. I'm never going to use it. And get the pipe out of here, too. Grab all the bottles. We're going to take these back up to the car. And then I'm going to head down the road. I don't have much of a choice. We got to find a shovel. We need to find a way. To make a shovel. Because I don't know how. And also a plastic bag. Now the question is, do we take our car? Because the car's totally juiced up on piss now. This thing's ready to go. It's almost full. But I think it would fuck up the environment really bad if I did that. I don't think I should. I think I need to purify the, uh, you know. Nice. How, uh, how full are we looking? 
That thing's full as hell, but it's not completely full. We're gonna take the road that way. Unless I see something over this ledge. Is that the dam area? I think I see something. But it's not a sa it's not safe to go down this way. All right, Chad, I need to go to the bathroom in real life. I'll be right back. All right, I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go, man. It's time to get on the road again and find ourselves a garbage bag. You'd think it'd be easier out here in a garbage area, but you'd be wrong. Come on. I suppose we will follow the road this way. Okay, we're gonna follow the road this way. And then we will uh, hopefully find a garbage bag. If we're lucky. I'm not going that way. <laughs> that way sucks. I don't like how something screamed over there. So we're going this way after all. What was that noise? Probably some fucking piss addict. Someone addicted like crazy to piss. Okay, if I had to guess. What is this? Well, it's full of slime, this place. What is this? What was this place? Some kind of sauna? I've learned that it's really good to check the backyards of houses for stuff. God, I really can't wait to have purified piss water so I can actually drive my car. Or just an easy way to reduce it. Because I don't even know how the hell... Combining things is really important. I know that. Oh! Alright, we'll have to go to the bathroom here from now on. This works. The trailer park. Last time we were here, the world ended. But this time, stuff's looking pretty okay. Oh! I'm getting really sick of that. I really hate that creature. I really don't like that fucking thing. Why are there toilet worms? Why are there toilet worms? Not gonna lie, that made me piss. Anyone in that one? Why am I tempting fate by going up to them and checking? There's a big ass bug outside. I'm saving. Bad save.
See, what's nice about plywood and wood is that I can fake having a successful house with it. By just building up a bunch of garbage that has no real value. Like, no, none of it serves any purpose, but it will make my house it look like it's competent and has, like, you know, useful things in it. Any garbage? We're just looking for garbage bags right now. Dude, I took your life. I swear that. I know I did that. Yeah. I can definitely say one thing about this game now. If you don't like bugs, if you're like a person that gets really spooked by bugs getting in your face, Urge is, uh, urge is a rough one. It's hard out here. Lots of bug meat. That'll feed me for a thousand years. And alcohol. God damn, look at all these bugs. Pesky bees. Loads of bug meat. This shit never spoils. You know that. You know, that's a, it's a common misconception that bug meat goes bad. It fucking doesn't. It fucking doesn't. Aside, unless it comes out that way. Nothing. Unless he's- yeah, it's gotta be pre-spoiled. Why would I not simply come out here every day to collect my what well, I will just I will describe it simply as a bounty of delicious meat. Like this place is simply infested by bugs that really aren't very good at combat and that telegraph their existence by making horrible sounds. Like I don't see why I wouldn't come here every day. The axe does so much damage to them. Alright, that's 10 pieces of food. That's big. Oh. Uh, I don't know where that tube leads. What we have here is an uncharted piss tube. And I don't know what, what, what one thing my Mima always said to me is don't go into a tube, you don't know where it comes out. Any loot? Okay, 10 meters as much as I'm gonna keep. We just gotta learn this map, chat. We gotta learn the map. What the hell is this? Really weird house. A weird place like this has gotta have, like, garbage bags. You know what I mean? Acid bottles, that's big. Can you use that to declog toilets. Who's out there? It's a bug. Bug. This place gives me the creeps. As in, like, I know there's something off about this place. Like, to, you don't just make a house like this. There's gotta be something else up here. I keep accidentally taking the bug meat, even though I know I don't want it. There's gotta be something else out here, chat. Why the hell would you just make a house like this in a video game? It's interesting that now that I'm learning the layout of the map, that's like a real part of the map. That is the city. So, like, I know, like, general layout, I'm starting to get used to it. I'm not doing this. I'm gonna turn back in, like, one second. If I don't see an ending to this around the corner. Do 
Turn back. I said so. We're not taking pointless risks right now. We're stabilizing. And learning how to get a, get ourselves, a, like, keep ourselves alive. Fucking God. Oh, he's going after someone deeper in the cave. Yes. <laughs> Caves during the day is just a bad fucking scene, is what I've learned. Really just bad during any time of the day. We're out of here. We're going back to the house. I think I see a nest over there. Ah, nature's so fucking beautiful. Look at those deer. You know, even in this dark environment, there's still some life and some beauty. We're going back to the house. Once we get there, we're gonna drop off our crap. All right. And then, I think I'm gonna try to go the other way. Where the scream came from. Once I get rid of these bees. All the enemies in this game have fear mechanics where they actually get like scared when they see a teammate die and they fly or run away. Like it's like a, all the enemies in this game have their own threshold for how like quick they get scared, including when you wound them. Which is why like sometimes when I hit an enemy, they just go right by me because I don't want to die. Which I think is why that chainsaw guy didn't attack me, was because I hit him in the head twice with an axe, and he was just like, oh, fuck that, and ran. I am not entirely sure I'm going the right way home. Well, I remember the slime. Wait, is that another warehouse? another warehouse it's not my warehouse but it's a nice one and this might be chat last time I was out here it was dark could this be the one with the guy in it no I'm not seeing a truck Well, we're gonna check it for loot. Pipe. Wire. Pipe. Give me a garbage bag. Now. The guy? There was a guy that was in like a basement of a warehouse that had a like fucking shovel on him. He was like a freak. And I got, like, an achievement called, like, Urge to Consume. He, like, ate a bunch and then died. He was this nasty boy. Well, it's good to know there's a whole town over here also to loot. I would even argue that it's technically a better place to live than the warehouse I chose. But I've already put my stuff down in that one. It's only like a fucking difference of a minute in the other direction. Und. I've officially committed. More sheets of metal. I just don't I just I just don't know what I'm gonna do about the garbage bag. I need I need is that a cave? Or is that just a cliff with like a lot of rocks on it? Cliff with a lot of rocks on it. Gotcha. Those those like weird pools gotta have something. They gotta do something. 
You know what I mean? It, it can't just exist for nothing. I don't buy it. Now we always have a way into the tube. Should we desire to use the tube? We can. Any day we... Chat. Can someone answer me a urge-based question? Is if there's anyone that like knows stuff about this game to any extent at this point now? If I... If I relieve my character inside of one of the runoff like sewage rooms... Does that raise the fog? Or does that keep it from getting up to the surface? I got- I saw a no and a yes at the same time. Which makes me feel like I'm not gonna get a good answer. Oh, hang on, I should use like real wood to make this. All right. Five now. Okay, so we can make a uh, sleeping bag now. <laughs> this looks really sad. But we can really clean it up and make it look nice. I live like this. Now this is a- now what we're looking at here is a real man cave situation. I don't know about all of you, but that's a man cave to me. Stop attacking my fucking doors. Get out of here. I need to go get wood so I can make the fire. And I'm gonna try to secure the other side of this thing. We will have a lovely home. It's just a matter of time. I swear to God. Nice, you got a room for your dog. Where is it? Okay, man. So, okay, man. How am I supposed to see the wood I collected down here? <laughs> I got it. I just need to light a fire so I can dump all of my fucking... bug meat into the corner and cook it. Oh, I know. We'll make our bug meat corner this- I uh, no, I actually want it as far away from the fucking cottage as possible, so just in case. Now, let's cook ourselves up ten old pieces of bug meat. That'll be really nice. Yep. Lovely, lovely, it looks delicious. Mmm, yummy, yummy in my tummy. Thank you for more meat. I, this game's nice. This game does remind me of Forest in the way that the creatures of this world really do just come up to me basically to feed me. Nice. That did not provide me with as much wood as I was hoping it would. Tomato has not yelled timber once. And I haven't. Did tomato just say yummy yummy in my tummy? I fucking did. I haven't said timber once, but I've said that many times. And why is that a problem that I said that? And why, pray tell, would that be an issue? Oh, how's the food? Is the food coming along? How's this coming along? 
Still looking good. I don't think all of this bug meat's being made into food right now. I think like half of it is and the other half is just sitting on the pile next to it. I need to pick like a goal for myself. Uh, landmine. No, that's not a good goal. Uh, Urid lighting. Uh, that's possible. I just have to go get an Urid rock. Dude, I need... Actually, you know what I need first? Yellow fog collector. Is this global? Chat. I need... I, I don't... I just don't know if this is gonna, like, matter. It probably... Surely it is. Because otherwise you'd be breaking, like, rocks of Urlid in, like, a cave and be placing one down next to it. It's got to work for, like, the general area around you. I might as well make it. It's not that expensive. I just need to pipe in some wire. Pipe. Wire. It's a good way to test. We need to learn the game. Now, what we have here is a Urlid gas collection system created by my invented by my grandfather to collect early gas from the environment and repurpose it into a usable resource I do not know what it does That's a fence. Stop piss-splaining us. Okay. Dude, where's the cooked bug meat? We'll just- you're getting hungry, you should eat something. I know, I'm waiting for the fucking bug meat to cook. This bird's just asking for it, dude. Alright, why is it to fly away? Do I give this like a test drive by making like pollution and another- Dude, I have to eat. I literally have to eat. I have to eat. I think I added too much meat, and it's made it so none of it cooks. We'll do three meats on it, and I'm gonna make another one. <laughs> We're, gonna <sighs> We're gonna cook up food just the way my granddaddy would have been proud of seeing me do. Three bug meat per fire. Yep. Do I have any plywood? In a chest, I probably do. Oh, I have to pee. I'll use my bottles. Very good. Is the food done? You piss in bottles? I live like this, motherfucker. Please, you need to cook. Okay, I got one. We're gonna be alright. It's just a lot of this bug meat's just not cooking as fast as I would like. But we'll live. We're gonna be fine. I'm gonna make more. I am going to truly make more fires. What a fucking goon I am, dude. This is the weirdest goddamn thing. Oh, hell yeah. Food's finally coming in. 
Milestone passed for perception. Easier time finding supplies, more ammo, longer hit range for melee weapons. Okay. Well, I found out we we definitely do get cold. Combine with salt peter to get gun powder. Okay, that's good to know. Wait. What happens if I like throw wood onto the fire? Something spat out more coal, but this was still active. I'm confused. Emission? No, guys, we're not getting an emission, though. I am going to seal up this door now. I think it's about time I do that. I don't want creatures to show up outside my house anymore. Of any kind. I've decided to adopt a no creatures allowed policy. Huge door. Huge door. Not symmetrical, I know. But huge door situation. Lopsided, I know. But it opens and closes. And now we have a sealed up lovely warehouse. Streams of ruined. Fuck you. you know how hard it is to make a house people want to live in as a streamer? Hard. Everyone gets so mad. Oh, I bet if I let the bu the food keep cooking, it burns and becomes charcoal. Even though that doesn't really make any sense. I bet that's how it works. Well, I'm gonna let that cook out. <laughs> we're gonna now. What we're gonna do is we're gonna let the uh, we're gonna let the meat just cook on up the rest of the way, and we're gonna just relax for the rest of the night. I think and take it easy. And maybe in the morning this thing will have done something. CO2 poisoning, here we come. I have some open air windows upstairs on the second floor. Obviously. They have windows. They're broken open. There's, there's, there's a fucking, there's a draft. What a beautiful day. What a beautiful goddamn day. I had to piss bad. Oh no. Oh no. Jet. That's it. Pollution or no, I'm taking the car here. I don't care. Car's gonna be fueled up. We're taking it down here. At a certain point, we need to get it. We're being careful already. Ah! Ah! Oh! Sorry, I'm pissing all over the ground because I'm slipping. I'm slipping. I, I, I'm getting all jostled. Ah! Just give me a second. Just give it a sec. What happened to my food? Why did that happen? 
my 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 bug meat I was gonna snack on that later is gone in this world literally safe scumming the PP game my guy every bone in my body broke two times in a row one time I can forgive two times I can't My meat better be done. All right, it's fine. We'll just let it cook. Look at that beautiful piss-colored sky. Let's just get to my horrible, horrible ladder that I'm gonna fall off of again. You'd think I would just set up a safer way to get up here. But alas, no. Oh. I have to pee. I have to pee. Hello, neighbor two architecture. True. All right, chat. I know it's gonna cause a lot of pollution, but we're gonna drive the car to try to get it down to the garage. You gotta love that fucking sound, that horrid sound. That just awful, awful sound. I guess I should loot this place as well. Cause we didn't loot. Was there a slime here before? Or is the slime new? Why? Look, once we get closer to the house, some of the, uh, some of the pollution will get sucked up by that thing. You know, that's good. Car's a real guzzler, huh? Yeah, the car loves piss. The car just fucking loves that stuff, guys. Come on. Ooh, a tarp and a protein bar and a lot of piss. Tarps are good. Loads of tarps. Still no garbage bag. See, tarp's important because I believe tarp is how we set a ceiling, house tenting. Wait a minute. No, I'm not gonna waste my fucking duct tape and shit on that. But when I'm at my base, once I make the stuff that actually produces, wow, that slime is really, really nasty. I have to actually break this open. In hell, leaves were like growing over it. <laughs> Disgusting. All right, so if we hug this cliffside, we should get back to where we want to be. Ideally, with as little fuel usage as possible for obvious reasons. Let's just try to get there. God, this car does not go very fast, though. That's the thing. It's not a good car. We might as well loot while we're here. Might as well take a look around. Protein bar, that's good. We like those. I don't think we touched those. I think that th those mushrooms or whatever are literally like explode into the gas. What is this house? This house is strange and it has some kind of spooky freaking basement and a dead man in it. D 
this dude had a goddamn, like, piss chemistry station. <laughs> this guy was making piss meth. I had to check all the walls. Weird. Walter Yellow. All right, chat. What? Is that my old car? Wait. This was where I crashed. This is where I saw P Man. This was the building where I saw P-Man. They all want the yellow. Don't let the fog rise. They all want the piss. Oh, I can watch TV here. Hang on. Dinner 13. We can finally watch our favorite movie. Okay, uh, well, um, that was fucking funny, wasn't it? Did we all have a good time watching that one? What? This is actually a goddamn, uh... This is actually a fucking crack lab. Is there- there's still- what, where is this stank coming from? Oh, thank God. Yes. It was me, your honor. You, you guys, the stink? Whoa, oh, oh, hello. Creepy bastard. Actual Slenderman picture, real. I'm not collecting any of these fucking rocks till I can make myself a goddamn purifier. This is like priority number one is 20 metal sheets, seven pipes, seven glue bars. We need that. Metal sheets ain't hard. Pipes is the hard one. I'm not sure how to do that. Like quickly. Some kind of bug outside. Making horrible sounds. I hate them. My friend continued this way. Whoever they were. I mean, I know who they were. They were my friend, but like... Well, are they really my friend anymore? I think they went towards the city. I gotta get my car to, to my house. I'm not gonna explore any farther this way. We need to stay focused on the task at hand. Hey, get away from my car! Should 
obviously the way we need to go soon. It's just I also want to loot all these buildings if I can. The P-Man was up here. I saw him with my own eyes. He was real. He was real. He was... He was staring right at me, that freak. Oh! Oh! There's nothing up here. Wherever he is, he's not here anymore. Weird. How I looks like the road goes straight to my house now. But loot this building quick. Plywood. Acoustic paneling. We got a streamer house. Yup, looks like one. Yup, looks like one for sure, for sure. Piss bottles? Not surprised. Okay. Uh... How to make an X. That's epic. I already knew how to do that. I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it, and that's why I didn't go near it from the front. Horrible. You must think me a fool. I don't need the alcohol. I knew it. I'm getting really too sick of these weird worms. Horrible creatures. Vile. All right. Get back to the house. So just tapping shift is how you drive fastest. Uh, I don't think that's intended. I actually think it's super not intended, but if I tap shift, my car just accelerates infinitely, which is cool. A matter of fact, I don't want to use sticky keys. Thank you. All right, car's looking good. Car's looking real good. I'm worried that this thing is uh, not affecting the entire environment. I'm worried it's not doing that. Oh, this is still lit, huh? Well, I can eat that later. We drop off all the stuff I have. It's time to start cooking. Okay, so we just need pipes. If we got pipes, we'd be able to finish the uh, thing. Like, we'd actually be able to make the purifier. We're not far off from it, Jet. That's pretty good. I think we just go and continue exploring the town. But, like, without our car, obviously. Because that's gonna... Dude! I know you should be collecting some of this, you piece of shit. Now do your job and collect. This tube makes me think I need to connect it to something. Wait a minute. No. Do I need to like... Do I need to actually... Hang on. Hold up. Collects Erlid. Erlid storage. Fuck. You're kidding me. I 
I need a container. But this wouldn't count. Hang on, let me get some pipes in my inventory for a second. I want to see if I can, like... God damn it, I think I actually need that. But I don't know where I'd get a fucking container! I swear I just heard a creeper. Nah, you're hearing possums. It's raining. Well, my house fucking leaks. Wait, no it doesn't. We're good. All right, I guess we're gonna head down the road. I don't know where I'm gonna find like a... It seems like the way the game is based is uh, that we need a higher perception and that's just gonna raise the odds of us finding good supplies. So being very perceptive is just like good. We're just gonna get the things that we need if we just loot more in general. Hang on, I see a big old bridge over here. Maybe we take a look around over there. All the wire's good, though. That's good. Your piss tank is gonna have water in it. Oh, no. You think that's gonna, like, dilute the, the, the tank? That's probably not a bad thing, is it? Just oodles of wire. It needs to be pure, pure piss. I'm gonna check out that house over there. Something's off about it. Matter of fact, I would say something's off about this whole goddamn lake. Something weird's going on. I don't like it. It's too wet. It's I'm gonna say it. This place is too wet, even without the rain. <laughs> oh, kind of fucking spooky. I love it when my boat is made out of plywood. Something while I was in this boat has begun sneaking up towards it to assault me. Oh no, it's just his garbage bag. Okay. Man, yeah, there's a lot of fish in this little pond. Still looking for anything that I can use for my poor fucking toilet. Just looking for a garbage bag, dude. That's all. Just need a garbage bag. Give me a garbage bag and I'll be a happy boy. Maybe there's something I can combine to get it. What's duct tape and cloth? Tape armor. I should probably be testing more stuff with combining. Huh. Glue bar makes plywood. What would this combine to? Nothing. Pipe. There we go. That's another one of the ones I need. What was this? 30, 49, 55, 84, 32, 70. Does that mean anything to any of you? Does that mean anything to any of you? Someone stole the toilet. Fuck. A 
There's a piss bottle back there. I'm not really sure I need it. Why is there piss? I wasn't peeing my pants. Why is there piss here? This game is so fucking foul. <laughs> this is session two, dude. I feel like you guys should be over it by now. Come on, relax. Relax. I'm gonna check out the other house over here. The dam! Duct tape. Still need a garbage bag. Still need a garbage bag. Still looking for a garbage bag. No garbage bag whatsoever. What's that? It's fucking. It's just a. It's a chair. Wait, what the hell is that? Is that a grave? And why in the hell, when I get near it, does the music and all audio stop? Yep. Why? Uh, well, I mean, I don't have that shovel I would need to, like, dig it up. Or do anything with it. Or I would, I would likely dig it the hell up right now. To be honest. I would. Dude, I'm not gonna piss on the grave, chit. Mainly because I can't afford that kind of pollution. There's a cave over here. I'm willing to take a quick peek inside. Maybe we'll see something we want to see for once. Hell, we could actually use some salt, Peter. I probably shouldn't go inside this. Can you also shit in this game or not? I don't know. I can't answer that. <laughs> Nasty slime. Every time I go into these caves, I regret it. Because it always feels like... They're so long. And I don't get anything I need. It's like late game stuff. Oh! You fucked up missing, my guy. Your gunk boosters are mine! These bugs are trying to protect something. They're trying to protect something, Chad. I'm telling you. Grab all this. Eat the food, grab the meat, we keep moving. He fell. Big fucking mistake, bozo. Yeah, man, eat shit! That's what I thought. Wait, I don't have any batteries. Oh, we shouldn't be down here. I'm willing to navigate a couple more feet to see if perhaps there was a reason they were protecting this place. Is it in the box? That box is fucking empty. Hello? Hello? 
do not approach me. I am not to be trifled with. It's an underwater piss river. Why am I doing this to myself? Oh yeah, I want anything out of this cave so I don't feel like I wasted my time going in it. That's what. Plywood. That doesn't really pay for it. We're going back up towards the surface now. I don't know what this is going to spit me out, but it's sunken cost fallacy as hell. It really is. Yeah, no, it really is, dude. Uh, I... These caves are massive sunken cost. But I'm going up, which is good to see. That's good. We want to be going up. We got plenty of bottles to piss into. And we're about to be at the surface, so we'll know where this cave goes forever. My eyes! What the fuck? Jesus! Where the hell are we? Huh? What? It's just yet more cave. It is just more cave. We have to go back. We can't go forward. It's more cave, chat. It's more cave. It goes back down into the ground to be more cave. We're leaving. We need to go back. But the loot. Yeah, 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 yeah. But the loot. But the loot. I only got one plywood from that whole trip. The good loot's just around the bend. But the trash bag. I ain't finding the trash bag in here. What I need to do is I need to find Shovel Boy. Chat, why can't one of you, like, go back into the old VOD, retrace my steps, and then obnoxiously tell me over and over again that I'm going the wrong way? So that I can eventually find the way back to what I need? Where's that addict? Where's the loathsome piss addict? Never should have come back here, motherfucker! Yeah, let that be the lesson twice in a row, idiot! Didn't expect me to come back through the tunnel the other way. Shut up, he owned your tomato. No, he fucking didn't! I've not been owned once this stream. Perhaps, yes, like last stream, I may have been owned. But this stream? No. Just spending some time trying to see if there's anything I can. What would I connect? What is duct tape and alcohol? Dude, my arm is gross. Damn, man. But it does more damage than my axe. Non-existent combinations. Good to know I can't mix that with anything. We need to get back before the sun sets, because God help me, we end up out here at night. We gotta get back to the bridge. Come on. Freak, freak, freak. What makes me a freak, chat? 
I'm confused. What about me is freak-like? Aside from me pissing and filling three whole bottles with piss. Left-handed. No. -uh. Oh, that was a Molotov. Oh, look what you made me do. You made me throw my worthless item in the total garbage. Wait, I have an idea. Yeah, I'm just gonna dump those and get rid of them forever because they are absolutely trash. And I'm tired of having inventory taken up by them. Is this a piss rock? Or is this saltpeter? I hope this is saltpeter. That's saltpeter, good. Welcome to Gol, Gol Nude? Is that the name of this fucking town, Gol Nude? Gull nude. I don't need all these bottles. I'm ditching one of them for the alcohol. I want to go a little bit farther down the road. Now that I know where I am. Oh, let me grab that other salt, Peter. Skirt! Chad, I actually do have cheat engine set up on- Oh, that wasn't even real. I have cheat engine set up on two times speed for this game if I'm doing like really long eventless walks directly down a road. Just so you guys know, because this game is long, slow walking. And there's not even like anything on the sides of the road to do, so setting it two times at least makes it a little more bearable. I would describe the layout of these maps like Monster Hunter. If you know what I mean. There's a lot of connecting routes where you should be using a car to get there. Like this. Truck. Is this a true dead end? This is a true dead end. I think. Yep. That is the end of existence past that. Okay, so good to know that that's the end of the map. Let's get out of here. I mean, I get- you're right, Chad. I could ladder up and see. But I get the weird feeling it's gonna be a waste of my resources. Let's see. Oh, I put the ladder down backwards. Apparently. Okay, now this has a this has an actual invisible wall on it. The truck. This truck is invisible walled. Yeah, no, nah, that's definitely the end of the map. No way. Otherwise, why would they even design it like that? <laughs> I mean, that's fine. That means we know where the edge of the map is. That's so far. I have not been able to find the edge of the map anywhere. So uh, good to know that this pathway is nothing at the end Rather than just going forever and this map continues to just get larger and larger with no end in sight honestly uh, That's just a nasty sofa What did you think was going to happen? Oh, he fell into an area I can't even harvest his meat. I don't even want bones. I want meat, my guy. Wait, I can merge saltpeter and cured bug meat. That's cool to know that that's an option. If I get saltpeter, which I do want to start getting. 
That was why I wanted to make like a compost thing, which that means I need soil. Which means I need a shovel. Which means I need to find that nasty guy from that fucking basement in that goddamn warehouse. And I still don't know where that is. Okay, time for a potential jump scare. I think I got too close to a bug nest. I think I got way too close to a bug nest. But none of the bugs are attacking me. I mean, I need food. Come here, you cowards! Come on, then! Wanna take a swing at me? Ha! Where are you running, then? Think I'm just gonna get pushed around? Yeah, right! This is my land! This is my land and I need to use that toilet in there still. Get off of me! Get away from me! Hug me. Where's the nasty boy? Oh, he's over there. There's also an addict. Oh, did that nasty boy knock himself out? I think he fucking killed himself running into a tree, you stupid idiot. Dude, he actually killed himself running into a tree over and over again. I don't see the nest anymore. I think it exploded. I guess that's where all the bugs did come from. Oh no, there it is. You better give me something good for this. Drop it. Drop it. Am I gonna start pissing in it? And that's how we take a swing at nature. All right. So are you telling me these nests are natural toilets? That I can use to relieve myself in times of struggle? I hate this game, but you can't look away, can you? You sick... You sick freak. I'm like, just checking to see if there's worms in the toilets. Oh, a fluid detector. We got one. I can use this to check how bad it is outside and everywhere. Hey, man. How you doing, man? You, uh... I'm just out here harvesting bugs. I don't know what you do. But, um... I hope you have a good one. Is this lake all his pee? What a wonderful, what a wonderful idea. Perhaps, perhaps it all is his pee. My guy pees a lot. Ah, oh, someone peed inside the fucking drawer. Dude, I'm, I'm trapped in the house. Oh, is the sun starting to set? Oh, fuck. We need to start getting back to the home base. Thank God, a battery. <laughs> My guy, you gotta get out of here. Okay, refill that. Grab this. We're getting out of here. We need to go back to the base now. This place has, uh... This place has become a bit of a mess. 
and no sign of the warehouse with the shovel in it. Guys, you guys gotta fuck off. Okay, bug meat's full. These bugs are all stinging me. Oh, I remember that hole. I might be getting close to being able to retrace my steps. I need to go across the accursed lake. I think the warehouse is somewhere on this side. Like, it's this direction, the one that I need to go to. And if I get that shovel, then we can get dirt. I think. I hope. For now, let's just focus on getting home before the end. Let me cook up some grub. I don't really want this alcohol. I hope that the, the pollution's not too bad. I've been really careful, but I'm still worried it's a little too high. It is nice knowing that I live, like, really close by, though. It's nice, like, knowing the map better. Because, like, I'm home already. No problem. Acid bottle. That's cool. Still desperately looking for a garbage bag. I'm worrying we're never going to get one. I'm getting worried we're never going to find that garbage bag and I'm never going to be able to make my toilet. Maybe we need to go inside the cursed tube. After all. Maybe that's what this is all about. Maybe we need to go down the rails. Another pipe. I think we're close to the pipe requirement. We're getting close to the requirements for the pipes. And then we can make... The Erlid Purifier. Use a pipe build or container to fill it. I still don't know how to... Wait. Transfer liquid from one container to another container. Okay, so I see where I can make the pipe thing. But that still doesn't change the fact that I don't have a container. Mm. Why is it so hard to figure out what to freaking do? Because this thing's just not working until I can make a pipe thing for it. Well, now I see how it works. But I still need... God damn it. I need a freaking liquid container. Maybe there's something I can combine with this. Well, that didn't do it. I had to check. That just broke it. That didn't give me an item. That just made me destroy it. Does this look different? Wait, it raised its damage. This is a better axe now. Huh. Well, then it wasn't a waste. Fuck off. Okay, what I want to do is I want to make myself a fire. Because I still can't make my fucking fire barrel because I don't have enough coal or soil. I don't know how to even get soil. Honestly, at this point, if someone actually knows the answer on how to get soil, if it doesn't require a shovel, you can tell me. Because, um, otherwise I'm going to be hunting down that. And I'd rather just know at this point.
It requires a shovel. And is there no way to craft a shovel? I have to... I have to get it? It's so dark in here. I think I make a candle. I just need some cloth. Wait, no, I need glue bars. I think we hang out by the fire. Not as far as I know. I know how to get to the warehouse from where you are, though. Okay. Uh, where is that from here? You can just tell me from this direction. I felt like it was straight this way, the way I'm facing. Now I don't know. And I really need to find it. That bug out there is really pissing me off. And I guess I could kill him to eat him. Oh, oh, that's bad. You don't want a bird inside your house. Oh, now it's gonna be smacking around all over the walls and stuff. When you exit the street, go right and follow the road to the highway. Okay. Because I, I remember it being on a highway, but I didn't know the way to the highway. That bird's a bad omen. I just need food to cook. Before I go to sleep. I'm gonna drop off everything else. Tomorrow we have a big day. Is that slightly yellow? This thing has been collecting. Is it full? That thing might be fucking full. That might be full of piss right now. I haven't pissed here at all. You are a real fucking rascal, you know that? Why does it take food so long to cook in this game? Chat. I'm going to sleep. If I wake up dead, so be it. I'm tired of waiting for food to cook. How can you wake up dead easily? Wait. Chat. When my character sleeps, he gets fully, uh, full hunger. Not one bug meat cooked, but I did get some coal. I need to pee. My guy needs to pee bad. Oh God, he's pissing on the ground. Uh, pee in the car. That thing, we used some gas in this thing. Nasty. All right. Big day today, chat. We are going to get out there and we are going to find, okay, that goddamn, all right, shovel. And then we will be finally cooking with gas the way, the way God intended us to. Come on. Let's ride. At two times speed. We gotta follow this road till we get to the highway. And it's not that warehouse. That one's not the right one. You could tell me you were running and I wouldn't know. I know. 
Oh no. Does this road? It feels like this isn't the road that goes to the highway. This feels like the road you don't take to go to the highway. Oh yeah, this is the bad road. You don't take this one if you want to get to the highway. You do not take this road. We split to the other side. Well, it's good to know this tunnel leads to here. We just gotta keep following the road. That's all there is to it. Chet is full of freaks. Okay, relax. That fish turned around to try to bite me, I could tell. I actually do think the fish in this game do attack you. I think they're evil. I think I think the fish in this game are nasty. Try it. Well, when I was testing the game and I attacked a fish, it bit me so hard it fucking instantly killed me. But I don't know if maybe something hit me from behind. But if something's gonna instantly kill me, I don't really know if I want to take any chances. You know what I mean? It was an amount of damage that I don't want to test it again to be 100% sure. This does not look like a main road. This fucking place is a total shithole. This ain't even a road anymore. This is a jump. God damn it. Stop looking at the fish. Okay. You should be looking for a shovel. Ah! 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 Maybe there's something in here. Mama, mama, maybe there's... Maybe there's something we can use in this place, like a, like a old bag. You know what I mean? We can make arrows with feathers. And I vaguely remember we can actually make a crossbow. I remember parts of the game. Very good. I did this by accident while I was testing. I never had time to do it the other the other day. Don't you fucking dare. Alright, this toilet's clean. This toilet's totally clean. Nothing in here. I think we just don't go back home until we find the thing, you know what I mean? We got it. We need the shovel. We can't keep progressing the game without a shovel. I think we just need to be out in the wild till we find it. Really nothing? Too bad we can't like break those pipes apart. Shovelless. I, it's so bad. I don't think this is main highway. I think I need to get down the road this way. Considering there's a sign saying, welcome to Schittsburg again. Or like, welcome to like, pee pee poo poo town. Yeah, all right. Inventory's already full, ditch the bug meat. This has to be the way. This has to be the way, we're looking for a warehouse. Is that it directly ahead of me? That's a big house up ahead. That might be it. This is the highway! Chat! The cheap man! <gasps> oh, hang on. 
I figured out where we are, chat. Uh, we're in Louisiana. Or specifically a place adjacent to Louisiana. We are in a we are in a uh, state adjacent to Louisiana, I believe. We're in Texas. <laughs> We're in Mississippi. Yeah. We're in beautiful Mississippi. A God's country. Damn, I kind of do regret not living here, though. I know this is like the original living spot, but maybe we'll move here eventually. It's just a much nicer area once we have a working car. If it wasn't for the body in the basement, if it wasn't for the horrible dead body, the stinking, rotting corpse in the basement with a shovel. Thank goodness, though, it's going to have that shovel. I need that shovel. I'm going to cook up some food while I'm here. All right. Should probably just make those meats first. I don't know. Bottle, ditch it, bottle, ditch it. Any garbage bags? <laughs> Why didn't I get rid of this fluid detector? Why did I need that? Stupid of me. Don't need the wood. I don't actually need the wood. I'm breaking these because I'm wondering if they'll give me plywood. Which is actually good. Huge plywood gains, man. Okay, so that just gives normal wood. This gives plywood. Gigantic gains, man. Why? Uh, I remember this place. I slept just here as I cowered from the creatures of the night as they attempted to eat me, to frickin' devour me. Really, really, really good times. Really, like, awesome times, even, I would describe them as. Tarp. Acid bottle. Both those things are semi-worthless right now. But I want to drop them and see if I can combine them with something. Tarp and duct tape. Tarp armor. Reduces air dust outlet when urinating out in the open. Put it on me. We already have tarps, so I don't really need to carry another one. Get that on me. All right, let's go downstairs. Brace yourselves. This is a little spooky. Oh, hang on. Yummy, yummy. Get ready, because what you're about to see is going to be a little uh, spooky. It's really dark really fast in here, Chet. I'm gonna look the rest of this place before I go down there. Keep holding out hope that maybe I'll find... I don't know. Something good? But I never do. Any chance for, uh, I don't know, um, you know, a bag? Plastic bag? Any chance? Hey man, that guy dead as hell. Give me this. Give me this shovel now. 
Uh, ditch the, uh, ditch this. Piss in this bottle, and then ditch it. Here, man. Something for you. For the trouble. See you later. Ooh, there's my last pipe. We have, if this comes, we actually almost have everything we need to like make a bunch of upgrades for the house. Can I just go straight to get back to my house? I no thinking about the trajectory, I think I can just follow like once I get on the highway, I can just kind of follow the way this way. I think this takes me towards the house. Like follow the electrical line. Yeah. Dude, that's like a truth. That's true. Like if I just follow this I get back to my house. And I want to go back to my house now. Although, how do I get dirt? Chad, we have the problem now of I don't know how to actually get dirt out of the ground. Uh, I don't know what counts as dirt versus just like map layout. The ground is made out of dirt. The game begs to differ. Piss on it to soften the soil. Don't be like that. Maybe it's gotta be this grody ass clay. Grab some of this. This is huge. Just ditch all the buck meat. I don't ever need that much. Six. Wait, I'm digging up Urid? Okay. Now, Chad, that's good for me. I made Urid arrows. That's great. I made piss arrows for my gun. I feel bad for any creatures that dare approach me now. I were back at Tarp House. I'm starting to get the lay of the land. Straight into the septic tank, Jet. Oh, oh. That was an accident. I fucked up. This was not the tube I wanted to go down! Oh, fuck me. This way is definitely gonna lead me out. I'm in the Mar- I'm in the Mario warp pipe. Yeah, no, I fucked up. I'm in the warp pipe. Uh, help! 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 Oh! Ah! Dude, please. I don't have enough ups. I don't have enough ups. Gotcha. I'm out. We made it out of there alive. We're going back home. Let's go.
No, that's fine. It would have spat us out somewhere nearby. It just wouldn't have been convenient, and it probably would have been a little scary to be somewhere I don't know the exit for. But we would have lived, chat. Don't worry. We would have lived. It's fine. Hey, uh, stuff respawns. Hey, stuff respawns. That's a good thing to know. Items by my house respawn. I don't know how fast, but that's more piss bullets on the counter there. Either way, we can now build uh, a fire barrel for cooking, which I think is step number one. I'll have to make coal. I don't know the fastest way to make coal because it seems like so far it's just been making a lot of fireplaces. So I guess I'll just cut down a million trees and burn all of them. Like just throw them all in the fireplace. These don't stack? The okay, acid bottles don't stack. Oh. All right, ditch this. Oh, we're still missing a pipe. All right, I'm gonna have to make a lot of fires and burn them all. Chat, it's okay. The only real pollution in this game is piss. What I'm doing has no effect on the environment. Do not worry. Please, do please, please, please do not worry. The only, the only pollution we need to care about is the d disgusting urine. This is totally clean. Stop biting your nails. That's blood crusted beneath my nails from killing. I'm gonna deforest this goddamn place. Just like my forefathers in Mississippi would have wanted. I don't want those ones. That's too far away. We're gonna need more coal than this. How much is that, 19? We're gonna need more wood than that. That's not even a real tree. That one gets to live. Well, we can start the process. All right. Time to get building. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now, is this the best way to make coal? No. Anyways, uh, let's go get the next trees. We need an awful lot. Dude, I still need a freaking plastic bag. You know what would actually be smart to check? What I can combine from this chest. Like with things. Rag or duct tape, we knew that. What can we do with the tarp? Tarp and duct tape is armor. We know both of those. Nothing merges with wire. Add it to the fire. Add that shit to the fire. All right. We're gonna need more wood.
No pollution, no plastic bags everywhere. Some post-apocalypse this is. True, man. This, this apocalypse doesn't make any sense. Can't make anything out of these bones. What the fuck? Ah, uh, well, it's good to know that that passageway isn't as safe as I once believed. Good to know that it's uh, got a train. Hang on, can I dig this up? There's nothing under here. Okay. Just wondering. The piss train. We don't want to go anywhere near that if we can help it. Why did I open this? Now that nasty gas is gonna get out. Cloth. How long has there been a cave back here? Chat, did I discover this cave at any point or has this always been here? Oh, what the hell is this fresh shit? Now this better be nice down here. I'm gonna get pissed. Hello? Easy there! Alright, that was wise. This place has been right under my nose this whole time. That guy tripped. Just fucking lunge at me, you idiot. Give me your meat. There is someone living beneath my house. Chat. There was just some goon living beneath- The light. The light! We need to get out of here, we don't have the batteries. I can't see! I can't see, we fucked up! We fucked up, we're gonna die! I can't see anything without my flashlight on. Oh yeah, I found the way out. Uh. Oh! Alright, we made it out. Uh, okay. Um, yeah, we're gonna have to, um, deal with that another time. Oh, we did get a cool protein bar, which I am going to eat. Never mind, it's- I found it. I didn't really get as much wood as I needed. Still need more. Dude, I need the coal. I need a faster, easier way to cook. I can't keep living like this. I'm so tired of living like this. Thank God items don't break in this game, ever. Chat, you ever notice how when tomato fucks up, it's we, but when tomato does something amazing, it's I? Is there a problem here? Is there a fucking problem here? You guys get credit for enough, all right? You get credit for enough. Why can't I have something? Why, 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 why can't I have something? Dude, my fire, my fire crafting is going to be so high, dude. I love RuneScape. I 
fucking love RuneScape! All right. <laughs> oh my God, I have to pee. Sure, I'm worried about when that thing stops, uh, just ex Whoa! What the fuck do you think you're doing on my lawn, motherfucker? The next one's full of piss. Okay? Back off, you piss freak! What? And let that be the end of it. Why can't I eat this guy? It's kind of freaking bullshit, but I can't. <laughs> Did you guys see that? All of my meat bounces all the way over to the farthest one in the line. Dude, this thing is absolutely the nastiest tool I've ever created. I really, really, really need to, like, figure out what to do about all of this. So, bones mixed with acid, duct tape, wire. Let's try the acid. That makes glue bars. Good to know. Though I don't know if acid is a good... Hang on. Ain't no fucking way that guy got back up. Ain't no fucking way. Where you at? Where you at? Come out. You better not be behind the house. No. Why do I have to get stuck with the goon? Useful to dispose of in a composter. We need to make a composter. Plywood, wood, glue bar. Why don't we make that right fucking now? Four glue bars. Well, no, it's because I wanted to make this first. Oh, this doesn't even require any of that. Yeah. Uh, the thing that was like more complicated that I wanted to make was an early purifier, but I don't have the storage method to actually get it out once I'm done using it. And now I actually know how to make everything for this. I just need a better way to make coal. But I don't know what's a better option. Please fix your fingers. I, I truly can't. I'm sorry. I really, really can't. I need to chop down some wood. I tried throwing wood on the fires. It didn't work last time. So is this game just about surviving? You can 
say that about almost any game with a survival tag on Steam, yeah. For the most part, yeah. They're usually about surviving. That's usually the point of them. Yeah. This one comes with some pissing mini games though, which are epic. Yeah, that is definitely not doing it. Compost, compost time check, compost time. Let's get excited, we're finally doing it. Okay, you prove your skill with ranged weapons on this. Just hit the head from as far as you can. Good to know, cool little thing. Time to make compost. And what's this one? Garden. Grow plants, mushrooms, and bushes by dropping them on this. You can also reproduce mealworms. Cool. Did this just say I have to piss on this to make it grow? Ah, uh, do I even, like, chat, what the fuck do I do about the goddamn early... It's really low here, I can only assume. But this thing is full to the brim with piss. Like, I don't know if I make another one. Or what? Because that thing's full. And like, I got these bottles, but like, that's not gonna get rid of it forever. Oh my god, this thing is full! Actually, no, it's not taking anymore. It only had one... Okay. Okay. It only had one bottle's worth of piss in it. Now I take this to the car. And I hope that the car accepts more piss. It did. Good. All right, I'm gonna make the composter. This is my life. <laughs> I can pour piss. Okay, no, this thing actually did have more piss in it. Why does this not look like piss in this bottle? What is in that? What's in this? Why is this- why is this disgusting? Where's my- where's my chemical searcher? I can't even scan it. Is that edible water? I- you shouldn't fucking drink that. That's a- that absolutely do not fucking put that near your mouth, my guy. You can't. My dude poured it out. And it didn't do anything. I think that was really water. Okay. You are the grossest fucking piece of shit I've ever met in my whole life, dude, in the video game. Holy crap. I didn't even waste 10 seconds before I did it. It's like his pants are down. Like, I, I don't even get why they even show my guy wearing pants. Because in the speed at which he pisses... Like, there's no wonder this is a yellow-tinted outfit, alright? This thing's soaking. This guy is nasty as hell. Holy shit. This should catch that though. But I think I need to put a tarp over this. Tarp inducted.
I don't want this to fucking place like this. Okay, it didn't. I just need some kind of like pillar. That'll do. Okay, it's too late for that piss. That piss is getting out. But I can definitely secure our future piss. Uh, why would I make it so small though? I fucked up. Why? There's no. There's been no limit as to how large I can make it. So why did I make it small? That'll totally catch the piss. For sure. For sure. For sure. I mean, it's a lovely little home. It's a, it's a really nice house, Jack. That's the thing. It's really, this place is lovely. We love this place. We really do. The meat's still not done cooking. But why do I even cook food when I know that when I go to sleep, I'll wake up fully rested. And the sun will be setting any minute now. This game really makes you feel like piss. Yeah, you're not wrong. Every time my guy walks by this, he pisses in it a little bit more. And it's the grotiest thing I've ever seen in my life. I don't know what the point of making like a water collector is because uh, I don't know. I get the weird feeling that I need, you know, some tubing for this. I feel like there's like things I don't understand about the liquid situation in this game. But I'll leave one up at the door here, I guess. Yeah, maybe that'll give me something good eventually. Hmm. Now, if only I could make a toilet. Now, if only I could get myself a toilet or something. Why does my guy have to do this? This is a basin of just piss and... DUDE! I need more meat or something to throw in there. That ain't gonna do it. No fucking way that is a tub full of piss. <laughs> There's gotta be more to like throw in. There is none. For miles, there's none. <laughs> it's, this dude needs to drink more water, like, so bad. Is it time to sleep? It's gotta be. I'm gonna go to sleep. It's not dark enough. Really? Really? I guess I'll just keep pissing into the piss bucket till then. He's not even drinking anything, so I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what he's pissing. I really just don't know what he's doing. Just like a whole bottle of it. But it's being caught by the tarp, which is no, it isn't. Well, what the fuck was the point of this thing then? How long is it going to take for these fires to finish? And more specifically, my food.
Can I go to sleep now? Big day today. I don't think that's doing anything to help me. At all. Did it, did it rain? No. This sucks. Like this actually is like awful. And there's not enough meat in there to even make it worth using. Does this just go in there? I don't even think that worked. Good news is, I have to wrap up. <laughs> Good news is... Good news is, I'm done for the night. I have to go to- I have to go to D&D. &D. I have to get the piss dreamers. I have to. All right, chat. I'm gonna go. I'll be back uh, tomorrow. We're gonna probably start tomorrow's stream earlier at like uh, 2 p.m. I'm thinking. Because I cut stream uh, short the other day. This is technically a four hour stream. Ish. Because, uh, my VOD was cut up, but, um, yeah, I'm still, I'm still dealing with abdominal pain, so I'm not going to go any longer tonight. I'll catch you all in the next one. Thanks for coming on by. Thanks for gifting subs and donating bits, etc. I'm going to send you guys over to Brett for d d We start in 24 minutes. So keep your eyes peeled for that. I'll catch you all tomorrow at... 2 p.m. ish EST. Goodbye.